Well, as we know, it's winter. It's very cold outside. You need a little bit of ready brick. Get the warm glow around you. Yeah, you can buy a packet of that in a shop. Cost your money. Do what I do. I get some pork, get some oats. Bag is normal oats. Filthy cheap. Put some. I've already got some in it. So put some in there. And if you make porridge, you use a lot of milk, don't you? No. Just a little dash of milk. There is already a bit of milk in there. And then the magic ingredients. Because I don't have fresh garlic to grate. Garlic, sorry. Garlic, great for breakfast, wasn't it? <coughs> Ginger. I've got a pot of lazy ginger as a backup. So, get some ginger in there. And then look on the, the good food shelf. Because everything on this top shelf, cinnamon, it can make bad food taste good. Put a load of cinnamon in there. Give it a mix. Just mix it all in. So that you end up with like a dough. It's, you know, it's, it's, it's just a little bit too, too weak. So it's, it's kind of kind of rigid, you know? Um, there you go. A bit more in there, that's probably be enough. Now this is an extremely cheap way of feeding yourself a very good and healthy breakfast. It warms you up, it gives you the energy through the day, and it's cost pennies. All right, what you end up with is something like that. I've already got my double grill, which I'm just gonna go and get it, my double grill uh, pan, which is on the uh, log burner, a little bit of butter in there just so that it melts it. There it is. <coughs> and with that, I'm just ma making sure that there's a, a covering of butter on the bottom of the pan. I'll turn this down, you might see it a little bit easier. Alright, and then all I do, scoop that out. Flatten it down into hmm, about the thickness of what you would do if you were making a cookie, I guess. You can see there, it doesn't look very attractive, does it? But does the stomach care what it looks like? And then all we do, we put that on the log burner. As you can see, possibly, we've got a pot of water already on there. Oh, need to warm the kettle up to make a cup of coffee. There you go. A very cheap, very effective start to the day. And you have nutrition, you get the warmth, you get the energy from the oats, which we put in back. Living in a small place means you need to remain tidy. And then have a, have a clear up. Now I'll take approximately, depending on the heat of the fire, which is quite strong this morning, probably about five minutes on each side. And we just sit there, and once it's cooked, in the process of this, I'm just rinsing out all the junk. And uh, don't call water is cold this morning. That's coming straight from the tank outside. Surprise, the pipe's not frozen, to be honest with you. Um, that happens occasionally. So I always have to bring a drum of water in and it's really cold, so that I have water in the mornings. And that's about five minutes 
flick it over, another five minutes, and when I get it out, put it on a put it in a bowl, a little bit of honey over the top, just give it that extra sweetness. And there you have a very healthy, all right, it doesn't look fashion, it doesn't look like it's Michelin star breakfasts. Definitely don't look like McDonald's double sausage and egg McMuffin. But it's nutritious, it's warm, it's good for you, and it gives you energy on a very cold winter's day. Simple, like me, effective, maybe not like me, but it works. It's as simple as that. Simple food, simple pleasures. Do I look like I'm hungry? Do I look like I'm starving? Do I look like I'm malnourished? All natural ingredients, absolutely perfect, isn't it?